I think obviously Pakistan were excellent in the most recent series against Australia and thoroughly deserved their win and they are a very formidable team in these conditions and we're well aware of the uh, the challenge that's in front of us as a as a team and um, we've worked pretty hard in the lead up to to hopefully come up with some plans to be able to counter some of the strengths that they have in their bowling lineup. You're never quite sure, I guess, until you get out, uh, get out there and, and in the heat of the battle. But um, I think we've got a, a nice mix within our group. We've got some left-hand, right-hand options as well, which probably Australia probably didn't have through the middle stages um, against their spin. And hopefully that's one of the factors that can help us uh, combat their lineup. Two spinners, two seamers, two rounders. So we've still got ourselves six bowling options, um, and uh, we'll obviously sort of go in with the uh, with the ability, hopefully, to take 20 wickets because. He says that's what's required to win Test cricket, um, and uh, I'm pretty confident with the bowling lineup that we've got. So pretty excited with uh, with the personnel within our group. I think we've got some swing bowlers, which, um, whilst it's not a big sample size, swing bowlers have been quite successful at Abu Dhabi as well. So that gives us a little bit of a uh, little bit of hope as well with the likes of Tim and, and Trent. Uh, and then with with a spinner that takes it away from the right hander and a spinner that takes it away from the left hander, um, we think we've got some attacking options. Well, it hasn't really changed. I guess our um, it hasn't affected us as such because we weren't involved in the series. So, you know, from our point of view, we, well, I guess from your guys' point of view, we definitely go in as underdogs. But I guess uh, underdogs or favourites is kind of irrelevant until you step out on the park and you perform and, and show your wares. So, for, for us, we we know how formidable Pakistan can be in these conditions. We know how strong they are, um, and and how uh, I guess nailed down their strategy is in these conditions. Um, but we've got some enthusiasm and some excitement about what may, what we may be able to achieve here. We had some success away from home against the West Indies and, and conditions which were foreign to us, and that was a real, um, a real groundbreaking series for this group of players. And um, you know, we're under no illusions how hard this series is going to be, but we also have got some pretty big hopes that we are able to achieve something special. So time will tell. Um, but well, we've certainly got, well, I think, the people that can uh, can make a pretty big dent in this series. Um, for young guys, I think they're very, very smart bowlers and, uh, and established players on the international scene. And we've got high hopes that those guys will lead us well with the ball this series.